What's up everybody? Welcome back to another Go To The Life Bat Review. We're back here at Hunter Hobby Park in Riverside, California. You see we got the boys back here. We don't have Arthur, we don't have Jesse today, but we got a good group with us today. So we're excited because we're going to be checking out another ASA USA bat. We haven't done one in a while, so we're excited to be checking one out for you today. All right, here we go. We got this Mike and Freak KP23 that is brought to us by Zach. You see his new unwrapper. This is Zach's baby right here. And in case you didn't know, we ended up busting up his Mike and Gold that we reviewed earlier this year. And this is the replacement bet that they sent him. So we're excited to check it out. I love the grip. Look at that color combination. The, the yellow really pops on this bat. And like I said, it is ASA USA play. We haven't done one in a while, Zach. Are you excited to swing this one up? Yes. All right, cool. There you go, you see that ASA USA stamp right there, Zach, it's, these, these, these colors are nice. They don't match your hat, but it's all good because they pop nice in this this uh, overcast weather. And I'm excited because it is a 12-inch barrel. Um, it is a two-piece composite bat. Look at that grip right there. We're super excited to be swinging it because it is ASA USA. And it does have that TetraCore technology. Um, and with the half ounce inload, it says max load. So that you know that means just a half ounce inload. So we're excited to swing it up. What do you think it's going to do? Uh, I think I'm going to put it over the fence. All right, cool, cool, cool. It's so like we always do, if it's new and wrapper and you brought it, you gotta open it up, brother. Hit it up. Oh, yeah. oh that was easy. Easy, look at that. Ooh. Oh, that was glossy with the wrapper, but look at that matte finish. Man, I'm super excited. Keep that stuff for the warranty too, bro. All right, here we go. Zach's gonna take his first swings with his bat. We're using 52 300s, the softballs, to break this one in. And uh, I think Zach's gonna be lining up some pretty good ones here. So let's go, Zach. First hit. Holy moly. That sounded nice. I like it so far. I don't think I'm going over the fence though. Especially not over the... out of the wrapper. Oh, shoot. Oh, knuckle. <laughs> I couldn't see it because of knuckle. Oh! All right, you got me. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. Dude, that's out there. Maybe I can get over the fence. I don't know. Oh. I like how it sounds. Oh, it sounds nice. Oh. That shit died. Oh. That one died. Oh. Damn. That is a baseball swing right there. Yeah, that's out there, dude. There you go. That's a shot. There, there you go. go. That sounded good. That's out there though. Oh, that's gone. That has to be gone. Yeah. Damn. Out of the wrapper. Oh, there you go. Man. That's fine. Nice, yeah. They wouldn't catch that in the game, so I'm fine with that. <laughs> Damn, I already scuffed it up. But geez. For a bat right out of the wrapper, this is pretty hot. Pretty much all line drives except for the bad swings. Good pickup, good pickup, and a home run. <laughs> all right, here we go. I'm gonna take my hacks with this. I don't think I'm gonna put it out like Zach did, but let's see if I can uh, at least hit the outfield. So let's go. Well, I hit the outfield, but I got jammed. It's all good. I felt it on the hands a little bit, uh, not gonna lie, but yeah, it's not too bad. Ah, oh, here we go. I just got underneath that one. I felt that too. It wasn't squared up at all, but hey, it got out there. Dang. That, couldn't even that one sounded it. good. Ah, there we go. Damn. I mean, it's not that far. Damn. What's that, about 200 feet? Oh, that was a good square. That was a base hit, not a home run. But I scored it up really good. All I felt was a little bit of a pop. That was it. That felt good. Damn. Right to Marcus. Beautiful. 250. Oh, no. Ah. Oh. Oh. I hit that one hard too. I don't know how Zach got that one. There we go. I'll take that. We haven't done ASA in a while, so it felt good to get a little bit of a different feel of uh, the crack on the bats with, this, with these uh, 52 300s. Um, it's a nice one, it's a nice one. It's still breaking in for my feel, it still feels like it's breaking in, but you saw how Zach hit it, he was launching them. Sorry, I got something in my mouth. Um, yeah, he was launching them, so I think it's gonna be a really good bat, whether you're trying to use a ASA tourney or use it on league night, it's gonna be a hot bat. So, 
get one. We'll put a link in the description if we can find one where you can get your own. Um, yeah, man, short barrel, not too bad. Again, I don't like the short barrels, but this one doesn't perform bad at all. So KP23, it's a beautiful bat. Felt great, sounded great. Zach's got a good one here, so let's go. Next guy. All right, we got Marcus stepping in for us today. Marcus, let's see how you do with this ASA bat. Let's go. That was good. Nice hard shot. Damn. That was a shot. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's Dude, you lined it farther than I popped it out. <laughs> that's it. Ooh, that's fair. Fair. <laughs> yeah, that thing had me frozen. Ah, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, that's all the way. Bye, you. There. I'm going to help. Yeah. That's a good one. Yeah. Bye, oh, you. One hop. Dang. That's not bad. I'll take it. Fair. Beautiful. My bad pitch is sorry, sorry. KP23, uh, nice bet. Thank you. All right, we got Alan here. Alan, the way this one's been shooting for everyone, I think you're either, either going to hit the fence or you're going to go over. So let's see how you do with it. Let's see how we do. I'm always at home with the mic in. The short barrels are a little funny to me, as usual. A little funny to you, right? That shit goes Okay. Still needs to be broken in, but um, man, when you catch it, it goes nice and stiff. He threw me that nice knuckle. I like that knuckle. There you go. Damn, I really love the sound of this ASA stuff. There you go. I'm pushing it 300. That's about my stuff. Oh, that didn't look like it's going to go that way. <laughs> Beautiful. Back him up to the fence, baby. Dude, that was a hard shot. That's a fucking nap. It still needs to be broken in, but you can't go wrong with the mic in. The short barrel's nice. Barrel's good. Uh, knob is kind of wide on it, but it feels good. Mikein's always nice. All right, that's gonna do it here for us at Hunter Hobby Park in Riverside, California with this Mike and Freak KP23, the max load, 12 inch short barrel, two piece composite. Yeah, it was a good bat, it was a good bat. I think in, in my opinion, once it does break in, um, it's gonna be uh, a re really hot bat. Like 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 I said, we, we replaced it for the Freak Gold that we swung earlier this year. Um, that one busted, so they, they sent this one to Zach, and I think this one's even better. So um, the durability, it feels like it's gonna be more of a durable bat. The handle felt good, the handle felt good. The knob, it's not too big, not too small. It feels great on the hands. This grip tape, I love this grip tape, man. Uh, Mike and I need to know where, where you get your grip tape made because I need some more of this stuff. And uh, yeah, the color scheme is beautiful. The matte finish is beautiful. And like I said, it's a good one. It is approved for ASA USA play, so it is good in all ASA USA leagues, tourneys, and anything else that you want to use it in. So, um, yeah, it's a good one. We're using the 52 300s, and it, even with those softer balls, it was launching. So you saw Zach, he hit one over. Um, everybody else was hitting pretty good with it. Even I got a couple of squared up hits. And, and like I said, once you square it up, you don't feel it too much on the hands or, at all. So um, it's a good one. It's a good one. Definitely recommend it, um, especially for those league nights where you want to shoot it hard through the infield. This was a really good bat. So get yourself one. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. We'll put a link in the description where you can find one. You can get one for yourself. And also, uh, yeah, show everybody some love. And as we mentioned in the videos before, Arthur is an affiliate with Pure Sports. So make sure you go follow Arthur. Arthur, and if you want some Pure Sports uh, equipment, use his code AREYES for a little bit of a discount at checkout. So, um, But for this one, my Kim Freak KP23, it's a good one. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll see you in the next video. Deuces.